Hey everybody. So one way you can make your lessons a little more interactive and especially if you're not doing any kind of Google Meet or live interaction with your students while you're doing at home learning. There's one way that you can add video to your lessons so that it's almost like an asynchronous type of lesson. So if I'm in my regular teacher dashboard and I click add and assign activity. Let's imagine for a minute that um, you found a great activity that you want to assign, but you want to do a little teaching to add to it. So I'm just going to use this one as an example. What you would do is click on the three dots down below, click copy and edit activity, and then you can change whatever you'd like in here. So what I'm going to do is go in and change the template. So if I click on the template, take a look on the right hand side here and you can see that there's different pages i can choose to add a page so i'm going to add a page and i can move these around to wherever i want so i'm going to click it and drag it up to the top now i have a canvas that i can add whatever i want to so if you want to record yourself doing a lesson you can be holding a whiteboard or whatever you want to do um to teach the lesson about uh what have we got here 10 frames um you can do that here so i'm going to click on the camera click on video and then we're all set to go so all i have to do is you know if i had my 10 frame here here's our 10 frame and this is how we count the numbers and this is what we're going to do blah 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 your students are seeing your um your face and and getting a little bit of learning that they wouldn't necessarily get at home from just a static uh, assignment. So it's one little extra step that might go a long way with making those connections with your teachers, or sorry, your, <laughs> your students. So I'm just going to stop this video here. So imagine for a moment that that video was recorded, you just hit the green check mark and save. And then you can choose to assign that.